I'm not here to like blow smoke and make people think that they can negotiate a 50% raise when you're basically entry level, when you're a resident, right? Realistically, you don't have as much leverage. But at the same time, that doesn't mean that you can't go in with having the understanding of what your market value is. You really have a good understanding of what a reasonable entry level salary is for a resident in your city, state. Find if there's like publicly available sources, but also just talking amongst yourselves. I don't, what's the culture of like medical graduates? Ooh, girl. Do you all talk to each other or girl. no? Tell ain't me. nobody talking. What? That's so, you're hurting yourself. <sighs> That's what we say all the time yeah. in medicine. Everything is cutthroat. I got you though, because early <laughs> in your career, it does feel like we're all like just emaciated street dogs, you know, fighting over scraps. <laughs> There's nothing is stopping you from networking with right. other medical professionals, even more senior, more seasoned than yourself while you're in school. It's a lot easier when you are a couple steps above someone in a competitive environment to be like, I'll throw them a bone because you feel <laughs> safe on your little pedestal in your perceived mind. <laughs>